Hey, it's Matt from Tradesman Digital Marketing. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through call out extensions, what they are, what the benefits of them are, and a few examples of what I would recommend on how to actually go about creating them and adding them to your account. So first off, what is a call out extension inside Google Ads? A call out extension defined by Google is a essentially a highlight of your ad. So whatever you have, what makes you different, what highlights your product slash service, this is what a call out is made for. And essentially what it does is it makes your ad a little bit bigger. And as we can see here, Google gives us the example of uh, Acme Electronics, competitive pricing. Uh, the actual call outs here are free shipping, 24 seven customer service and price matching. Now, depending on your service or offering, these could be much different. These could be, you know, certified installers, uh, lifetime guarantee, two year guarantee, award winning. Uh, there's just so much you can add here, but, but it really highlights what makes your business different and why individuals should go with you. Now, I absolutely love adding call outs to our Google ads because they make the actual ad bigger and the bigger the ad, the more likely someone is to see it. It, the more likely they are to click on it and this makes the click-through rate a little bit higher which you know improves ad rank which then allows you to lower your cost per click which allows you to get more leads which makes your account much more successful so for any extension I generally recommend as long as it's relevant I would say add it make your ad as big as possible make it as noticeable as possible so it gets clicked on uh, you can also add in a whole bunch of different things you can add it to the ad group level the campaign level the account level uh, I generally recommend either the campaign level or the account level depending on what services you're offering Offering. If you have very different services, I recommend just adding it at a campaign level, having one service and one campaign, another service and another campaign, and having separate call out extensions for them. Now, call out extensions don't always appear for every single ad, as you can see here, but they do generally appear if your ad is good enough and Google chooses when to show them based on essentially your ad rank, uh, the previous history of the click through, the landing page experience, a whole bunch of factors really go into determining whether or not Google should show your call outs. Uh, but most of the time, if you have a good ad, a high click through it, your landing page is good, your call it should be showing. But that being said, they won't always show. Um, now, how do we go about actually creating a call out extension inside Google Ads? What we have to do is come over here to extensions. We're going to click on our campaign. We're going to click on ads and extensions. We're going to click on extensions. And then we're going to click on the giant blue plus icon. And we're going to come down here to call out extension. Now this is going to pop up and it's actually going to show us the preview over here on the mobile setting and the desktop setting as well. And we have the building blocks of what we're going to need for a call it extension and adding it to our account. So as you can see here, first off, we can add it to the account level, the campaign level or the ad group level. Like I said previously, I generally recommend adding it at the campaign level. I really like to segment and theme my campaigns for each service. Say one campaign is fencing and then another one is uh, landscaping. These are very different and they really have different call it extensions that should be associated with them. And I would recommend running your call it extensions at the campaign level in that scenario. If your services are all essentially the same and your call it extensions evenly apply to them, I would recommend running it at the account level. For the ad group level, I really don't see much use in adding them to the ad group level. I think it's too detailed, it's too minute, and it's just a waste of time for most accounts inside Google Ads. That being said, I'm sure there are scenarios where the ad group level would be fine, uh, but I think for most campaigns, you can just either set it at the account level or the campaign level. Now moving on, if we already have extensions, we can hit use existing extension, but in this video, we're gonna hit create new, and we're gonna come up with a few call it extensions. So first off, uh, we could add in award winning. We'll do this one for pools. I really like pools, uh, and I like running pool campaigns. So award winning pools, uh, certified installers, um, 24 seven service, Uh, instant uh, quote, <laughs> instant <laughs> quite, uh, instant quote. And these are some really good call it extension examples. I've got a few other ones in here already. Uh, instant quotes available, 24 seven service, lifetime guarantee, award winning pools, two year warranty, uh, 20 years of experience, free pool consultation, lifetime guarantee, get a free quote, certified installers. Uh, the list goes on and on. You should really spend some time going over what the highlights of your service are and what makes you different and then add them into your actual call-out extensions. You can add a much more. Uh, I would recommend adding as many as possible that are really relevant to your business and highlight your service or offering. Uh, that being said, the more you add, the more chance there is Google really likes one, sticks with it, and shows it more often. Thus, you know, 
boosting your click-through rate up because people are going to see your ad more often because it's bigger uh, and your account is just going to be more successful because you have a higher click-through rate higher ad rank lower cost per click more leads you know overall account success is going to be much higher than if you didn't have all these call outs that being said there are advanced options if you'd like to schedule this for whatever reason you absolutely can I don't recommend scheduling extensions individually. I think it's too minute. I think you should just schedule it at a campaign level. Uh, I think it's much easier to manage that way. Even at an ad group level, I think it's too detailed. I would just suggest scheduling at a campaign level, leaving it as that. Uh, most extensions are just too minute to you know individually uh, schedule. But if you want to do so, you can absolutely do so by, uh, by clicking on start date, setting a start date and an end date. Uh, you can also set it for the days and hours you want them to run. I really don't know of any reason you'd only want call out extensions to run a certain day of the week maybe there's a reason i can't think of any uh but if you choose to do so you can set in a schedule now once all of this is set up we can hit save and our call out extensions have been saved and we'll start running inside of our ad account as you can see here so if you have any comments questions or concerns about call out extensions leave them in the comment section down below i'd be happy to answer them other than that you guys have a wonderful day and take care